Hello scholars and musicians, welcome to this week's music moment with Miss Nakamura. Today you're going to be focusing on your pentatonic scale. We're going to be doing some singing that will help us remember the pitches plus some hand signals to go along with them. What does pentatonic mean? What information can you get just from looking at the word? What other words start with the prefix pent? such as pentagon, pentomino, pentathlon? What do all of these words have in common? That's right, the number five. In music, pentatonic means five tones or pitches, specifically do, re, mi, so, and la. In class, we've used several different ways to sing these pitches, such as using the letter names on the xylophones, C, D, E, G, A, the pitch number of the scales 1, 2, 3, 5, and 6, and the solfege syllables Do, Re, Mi, So, and La. For this lesson, we are going to focus on the syllables so you can sing them anywhere, anytime. These syllables also have hand signals that you can use too. All right, so we're gonna learn our hand signals for the pentatonic scale. So it's not the same as do, re, mi, fa, so. So we have to pay close attention to when these pitches change. So let's practice the first three because those are the same as before. Do, re, mi, Let's try that two more times. Do, re, mi. One more time. Do, re, mi. All right. Now, the next two notes go so, la. Can you try that with me? Starting on so. So, la. Right, so let's practice me so la together. Me so la. One more time. Me so la. All right, now we're going to combine all five together. Let's see if we can sing them with the hand signals. Here we go. Ready and do re. Mi, so, la. One more time. Do, re, mi, so, la. Sounds good. Ready for a challenge? Let's go down from la, so, mi, re, do. So we're gonna start up here. Here we go, here's your la, and go. La, so, mi, re, do. Let's try that two more times. La, so, mi, re, do. And one more time. La, so, mi, re, do. All right, friends, the song that we are going to be singing today is called Ida Red, and it uses only five pitches. Let's see if we can guess which ones those pitches might be. What do you think those five pitches were? I'll give you a hint. They're the same ones that we learned before. Let's do the hand signals for that together. Do, re, mi, so, la. Awesome job. So 
Now let's try singing the song together. Down the road and across the creek, can't get a letter but once a week. I'd a red, I'd a blue, I got stuck on Ida too. All right, let's try it with some music. Down the road and across the creek, can't get a letter but once a week. I'd a red, I'd a blue, I got stuck on Ida too. How do we do? Let's sing this slowly. So I want you to repeat after me on these syllables. Do me so so me re do me so so me re. Do me so so la so me so la so me re do All right What do you think those syllables represent do they sound familiar? Ah, oh, good observation. Yes, these syllables make up the melody pattern of Ida Red. And since they use the notes in the pentatonic scale, we can use our hand signals to do this entire song. Let's try doing Ida read very slowly with our hand signals. So, you will be singing the words and following along with me on the hand signals. So let's go very slowly so we can keep up with those hands. Down the road and across the creek can't Get a letter but once a week. I'd a red, I'd a blue. I got stuck on I'd a two. Want to do it again? Sounds good. Let's try it one more time. Here we go. So we're starting on do can you make your hands fists like this great here we go down the road and across the creek can't get a letter but once a week i'd a red i'd a I got stuck on Ida too. All right, nice job, you guys. And that was this week's 2-3 music moment with Miss Nakamura. Have a great week, everyone, and I'll see you next time.